As you may have already gathered, I strongly believe that informal English learning is by far the most effective way for your children to learn English naturally and ultimately reach bilingual proficiency in the language. However, having said that, I also believe that formal English learning still plays an essential part in your child's learning of English. Formal learning implements a certain structure to what your child needs to learn, as well as a certain discipline to how and when your child will learn. Formal learning is particularly effective when used to complement your child's natural learning. For example, formal learning is an effective way to correct grammatical mistakes that your child often makes. Perhaps your child is naturally trying to put ED endings on verbs to form the past tense. They need to be taught that many verbs in English are irregular and that these irregular verbs need to be learnt. Of course, you can still subtly correct your child in an inv informal environment by repeating what they have said and including the correction, but formal learning can help your child see the bigger picture. So what do I mean by formal learning? Well, obviously your child will almost certainly be learning English from the age of five or six at their school, which is great. But ideally, it would benefit your child to first of all be learning formal English earlier than that. But anyway, to be learning formal English in addition to what they are taught in school. Private lessons are an option, whether that be with a one-to-one -one ESL teacher or within an age-appropriate ESL class. And younger children will very much benefit from attending Helen Doran classes. I've included a link to their website in the supplementary materials. However, these private lessons cost money and unfortunately not everyone is in the position to be able to afford them. They can get quite expensive. An alternative option, if you have the time of course, is for you or your partner to teach your children in a formal environment. And that is basically what this section and the following section is all about. An attempt to try and help you be able to teach your children English in a formal environment. In this section we shall look at classroom management and discipline and how important that is. And then we shall look at how we can best go about making your lessons both engaging and fun. Then in the following section there are a number of actual lesson plans that you can follow to teach your children which come together with a high quality colourful worksheet which your children will enjoy to learn from. These lesson plans cover a range of themes, vocabulary, grammar and are categorised according to the ESL classification of English proficiency. I intend to add to these lesson plans over time but obviously there is only so much that I can produce personally so I've also included a work in progress resource where I shall provide links to other quality worksheets and lesson resources as and when I find them. These two sections are primarily intended for parents who would like their children to be fluent in English or the parents of bilingual children and who would like help with teaching their kids in a more formal environment. But to be honest, this is also a good resource for English teachers, whether you are teaching at a school or teaching privately, a TEFL teacher, a TESL teacher, these two sections will be of particular interest to you. So that is all for this lecture. Um, thank you for listening.